319 says, uh, to know the love of Christ, which passes knowledge, that you may be filled with all the fullness of God. So if you want to be filled with the fullness of God, then you need to have the love of God. Now I'm just going to use my arm here, uh, vertically, as the uh, mark that most people are asking. They're asking how much you know, what's your degree, or what school did you go to, or you know, uh, who was your professors, who taught you, etc., etc. How much do you know, right? But the Bible says, in order to come to the fullness of God, you need to have the love of Christ. Now, here, watch my other hand now. Which passes knowledge. You, the love of Christ has got to go past what you know. If you don't have the love of Christ that passes knowledge, you will never have the fullness of God. Right. Because God is far beyond anything we could ever fully know. Absolutely. At least in this body. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, we have to pass knowledge. Yeah. The That's love of Christ must pass what you know. Absolutely. Okay. Amen. And knowledge will be a byproduct of that, but it's not the main thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> People make knowledge by, look, look, my brain is swelling. It's huge. Yeah, well, it's it's kind of like... They what, make it the main thing, and it's not. It's kind of like what Dr. Kelly Varner used to say. It's not, uh, you're not necessarily wrong. It's just incomplete. Right. <laughs> it's just incomplete. Right. We need the love of God that surpasses it. Amen. Yeah, absolutely. To that's, be filled with the that's, fullness that's awesome. of God. Yes, yes, awesome.